What's revolution? What's change? What's good? What's bad? What's new? And what's old? Revolution is all about change. Grow your numbers and be counted. Change in numbers. Change. Different than the last time. Change. Change. Change for better. Change for worse. Change. Change nonetheless for the better. To better yourself. To, to do what you're supposed to do. Change. Change in growth. Change. Change to make a difference. Change to make things count. Change for good. Change feels real good. Change to make a better life for yourself. Change for the better. Change to better yourself, man. You can't bicker and complain about the same old shit. Sit back and look at your life and when you get old and bitter, how you gonna change? Hmm? How you gonna look when you get older? Are you gonna change for the better? You're just gonna complain about shit until you can't complain no more. So life itself is a waste of your time. To your bitter old man sitting on the corner drinking a beer, wishing that you still had the hair you used to have, wishing that you made a difference, wishing that times were better than what they are, wishing that you had it going on. When you were younger. Wishing that girl would have never left you. Wishing that you always had a better shot at what you got. Wishing that you could just comb your hair over to the side to hide that you're getting older. Revolution. This revolution will be televised. This revolution is what we all need. This revolution is the only real revolution that counts. Desperation kicks in when there is no revolution. When things go bad, there's no change. There's no change.
No change at all when people don't give a damn. People don't care. People just get selfish and just want for them. Mine, mine, mine. Mine, it's mine. All mine. Greed. No room for anything when you're greedy. There's no room for tomorrow without revolution, without change. Tonight, tonight I got a traffic ticket. I got a ticket from coming back from getting these clippers. Young white cop. I'm going to say white cop. Because he's a young white cop. I didn't have no driver's license. I did not have proof of insurance. But I'm sitting here right here talking to you. Did that young white cop have to let me go tonight? Nope. By law, he could have took my ass in. I should be locked up right now. By law. Legally, that young cop had the right to take me down. I couldn't say nothing about it. Like he said, you know better. You live right around the corner. You know the speed limit. He didn't give me a speeding ticket. He says, you know better. You know what you're supposed to be doing around here. You live right around the corner, man. Come on. You're doing 40 and a 25. Come on, man. All I could do is tell him who I was. All I had in my pocket was my ATM card. The revolution. Is it because he was a young man? A young cop? Or is it because I was honest? But I did look crazy. My hair was all messed up. I was looking wild and loose. And my basketball game was on. and I'm missing it. But that's fine with me. I missed the first 30 minutes of the game. So I was right down the street from the house. Pulled over. Pulled over for what? Because I broke the law. That was on me. But the young cop was nice enough to let me go. I told him who I was, gave him the only good idea I had. He wasn't a dick like most cops. He wasn't an ass, even though he could have been. He was a respectful young man, just doing his job. And he let me go. That's more than I can say about most cops I've ever encountered in my past. But I have seen a lot of great good cops, nice cops. And maybe with some kind of revolution, it changes. You don't have to be an old fogey. You don't have to be some young punk for change. Here's the ticket right here to prove I'm telling the truth. Just got pulled over. Officer Names was the coolest cop I've ever met. Because he could have been a dick. By all rights, he could have been a dick. Sometimes we need to stand up and be honest and change and make revolution. Until then, you've been tubed. 